welcome, welcome, welcome to another episode. Welcome to another episode of Gamecocks Talk with Captain Will. I'm your boy, Captain Will. Make sure you like, make sure you share, make sure you subscribe to Gamecocks Talk with Captain Will so you continue to bring that, so I continue to bring in that gospel of Gamecocks every single day. You are now rocking with the best. And since you are rocking with the best, come rock with your boy, Captain Will. To, today, today, we start the quest for back-to-back national championships. We started the quest for back-to-back national championships, and it starts with Norfolk State at 2 o'clock p.m., 1400 for all my military heads. Today on ESPN, it begins today. We are 49.5-point favorite, which means that we're going to see everybody play. We're going to see everybody play. We're going to see every player that has a jersey, that has South Carolina. We might see some players in the we, – we, we, some former players – Back, I'm talking about 30, 40 years ago, might get a chance to come into the game today. You might see some 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 nine-year-olds coming in the game today. That's how good South Carolina is. That's how good South Carolina is this year. We have an amazing team. We have an amazing team. The championship begins today against Norfolk State. Norfolk State, I think they were 26 and 6, won the MEAC Conference Championship. Norfolk State is a good team. But there is nobody who are who's playing this weekend. And I'm talking about Norfolk State. I'm talking about potential opponents of South Florida and Mar Marquette. <laughs> Marquette. Marquette. There is no one that could compete with the Gamecocks this year. As long as the Gamecocks play like the Gamecocks, we're not gonna lose. We're not gonna lose. This team is better than last year's team that won the national title. This team is 32-0. This team has experience. This team has depth. This team plays the best defense in the country. This team has two, two potential defensive players of the year. They should just go in and just do it. Just do when the, when Naismith, uh, defensive player of the year, comes out. Because we got two out of the four. Just do it, Cole. Let's do a co co defensive players players of the year: Leah Boston, Bria Bill, Bria Bill, Leah Boston. That tell you how good of a defensive squad we are. And you could throw Leticia and me here in there as well, who, play, who plays amazing defense. Zaya Cook plays amazing defense. But it's led with the, the two headed monster is Leah Boston and Bria Bill for defense. Every team that Carolina plays going forward. We have to deal with that defense because every game, not the shooting is not going to be on point. The shooting will not be on point. But what you have when the shooting is not on point, you got the best offensive, defensive rebounding team in the country, along with the best defensive team in the country, along with one of the most experienced teams in the country, who is playing the first two rounds in Columbia and play all the way up to the Sweet 16 in Greenville. Are you tell uh, it doesn't South Florida? South Florida can shoot the ball. They can shoot the rock. They're a very good shooting team. Their best uh, uh, chance against the Gamecocks, if they get past Marquette, would be uh, just just shoot, 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 shoot. That's it, and hope you make all of them. Marquette, who who happened to beat UConn the game after we beat UConn. Plays that ball control, slow it down, hard nose defense. I tell you that. I tell you this right here. Marquette, you try to play that 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 way against us, y'all getting y'all getting trounced, getting trounced. But first, you gotta get past South Florida. I'm not I'm not worried about any team this weekend. Not fearing any team this weekend. None. Matter of fact, I'm not fearing any team in this country. None. Because as long as South Carolina plays like South Carolina, we're not gonna lose. A lot of of, of mishaps will have to happen. In order for us to lose. But with the focus this week is first Norfolk State, then the winner of South Florida and Marquette. That's the focus. Then we'll move on to next week. Move on to next week. But it begins today. It's a new season. It's a new season. It, the, women's basketball, March Madness, all this stuff. That's going down now. It evokes 
that that whole notion that anybody can be anybody on any given day. Anyone can lose a ball game. That is not true with South Carolina. Hear me out. That is not true with South Carolina because of the depth that we have. So say, say, just say that Leah Boston gets in foul trouble. Leah Boston gets in foul trouble. She only plays like 10, 15 minutes in the game. We still got Camila uh, Cardoza, the six foot seven Brazilian shot blocker, six woman of the year for the SEC coming off the bench. There is no other team in this country that has that. No one. No one. Kiara Fletcher, our starting point guard for most of the year, goes down with an ankle injury. Who comes up? Raven Johnson. Raven Johnson, who was the number one point guard coming out of high school two years ago. The number one point guard running the show. There is too many levels to the South Carolina game cost you got to get through in order for you to have a chance to beat us. It ain't happening this weekend. It ain't happening this weekend. It, 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 it's going to be the thing about Don, the, the thing about Don Staley, the thing that she has to work on this week is just keeping everybody healthy. Just keep everybody healthy. Don't play anyone that many minutes. We don't need that. Kara Fletcher. Coming off that ankle injury, just play a few minutes. Just get your timing back. Just play a few minutes. Just play a few minutes. We This weekend, no. No. It, to, uh, today's game, everybody going to play. Everybody, everybody going to play. From 1 to 13, everybody going to play. Just stay healthy. Get ready for Sunday. Keep your legs good. Everybody, this is the first step. We need to win six games. To be hoisting the championship trophy. Once again. Six games. The first. Game is the day. At 2 o'clock. I would say around 345. The bus. The bus will be warmed up. The Chick-fil-A. No nah, not the Chick-fil-A. The Bojangles will be primed. And ready. And we will send Norfolk State. Back up to Virginia. And we will get ready for the next game. First game today. Five more to go. This concludes another episode of Game Cost Talk with Captain Will. I'm your boy, Captain Will. You are now rocking with the best. And since you're rocking with the best, come ride with your boy, Captain Will. Let's go.